Welcome back, slow riders. I only have a short time with you right now because my GoPro mount, something happened to it. I got a new mount, or new new clamps anyway, not the mount, but the little clamps. And if for some reason this one just this one just won't tighten. So I'm sitting there holding it up with my hand, so this isn't gonna last long. But I just wanted to just see where I am. I made it through Death Valley. As you can see, there's trees and life here. So I'm on 395 in California, I think. Yeah, it's got to be. And I don't know what these mountains are. I guess this is getting close to the end of these mountains. But they are incredible, majestic. It's a long, long line of mountains or a range of mountains. So... I'm gonna have to look that up, figure out what they are. Yeah, Death Valley. I once I got in there after I stopped and got a drink, and I kept going. I had got like at least two two hours, maybe close to three hours, before I completely got out of there and over to 395. And it was just so I just wanted out. I was like, just get me out of here. Um, and then I came out to 395 been on 395 for probably an hour and a half to two hours right now and this is a beautiful road uh, just great scenery on each side now we're heading up to higher elevations when I stop for today I'll figure out what the heck is wrong with this GoPro clamp and hopefully get that tightened up I think I've got an extra one and you'll see here what happens to my GoPro when I let go of it. So shortly after this clip that you just saw, my GoPro actually fell off my helmet. And I use a mount, I've been using several of them and never had a problem with them. But this particular one on my new helmet, uh, it's made by Chin Mounts. And it actually fell off my helmet with the GoPro attached. And I was riding at highway speeds and luckily was able to catch it 
it sort of fell in my lap. So I was able to hold on to it and slow down. I was able to put the GoPro away safely. Uh, but it was kind of odd because the side that became unattached from my helmet was actually the side of the sticky tape that's applied by the manufacturer. Uh, I wasn't expecting that. I would have figured if it came detached, it probably would have been the side that I applied to the helmet. Uh, so I think the issue may be to do with that fact that that new style mount or, or for the, the style for this new helmet actually doesn't have a lot of surface area and maybe it's just a, not enough to handle the weight of the GoPro and the, and the little clamps that it uses. So once I got to my destination, I got a new mount. This is one's called a Motor Rads, and I attached that and I rode around Grants Pass in Oregon uh, and around the area there. And that this mount has seemed to have been doing fine since then. So fingers crossed, I'll get footage of the rest of this trip, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching.